All right, what's happening, y'all? So we are about to get into a video by the detail. This one is Michael Jackson and Tatiana, lover, user, or obsessed fanatic, part one, the detail. So without further ado, guys, we just gonna hop straight into this video, so let's go. Tatiana Thumson, best known for being Michael Jackson's video vixen for his 1987 chart-topping hit, The Way You Make Me Feel. She was handpicked by the artist because of Jackson's explicit attraction towards the young model. Slinky and sensual with flowing tightly curled hair, porcelain skin, and chiseled features, many believed Tatiana was meant to represent the female manifestation of Jackson. Her innate blend of sex appeal as well as childhood innocence appealed to the artist, and a relationship developed between the two over the coming months. Oh. However, after multiple private interactions and show performances, including that infamous on-stage kiss, Tatiana was all of a sudden dropped and iced out of Jackson's inner circle with no further explanation, leaving Thumson utterly devastated. But what invisible line had she crossed? Did she prove herself to be a traitor, manipulator, or an obsessive fanatic of Jackson? Here is the full detail. She probably started talking and started talking too much. Her background. Tatiana Thumson was so born in Clearwater, Florida. As a child, she developed a love for dancing, and at the age of 13, she moved with her parents to New York and attended the American Ballet School. At age 17, Tatiana Thumson decided to quit dancing to pursue a career in modeling, and soon after, Thumson signed with Ford Modeling Agency only to be dropped a week later. Being a mix of African American, Cherokee Indian, Cuban, and Irish, quote, they just didn't know what to do with me. They told me, you're not black enough and you're not white enough. I was what stunned and saddened like? by this, even <laughs> though I was warned by the established model Janice Dickinson not to work with them. Tatiana Thumson then signed with Zolly Agency, who secured her a contract modeling in Japan, becoming one of their biggest models for the next five years. Thumson's first experience as a video girl came when she appeared in Herbie Hancock's 1985 single, Hard Rock, in a high-energy surrealist film shot in the New York City subway system. Before working with Michael Jackson, Thumson was already a massive fan, having apparently burst into tears when she was unable to get tickets to see him and his brothers perform during 1984's Victory Tour. However, that same year, while on her way to one of many casting calls, she recounted how she could not believe her luck when she came across her idol alone and pounding the pavements of New York City. Dressed casually in jeans and a t-shirt with a cap pulled down low on his face, Tatiana wanted so badly to stop and talk, but she just could not figure out what to say. Thumson trailed behind Jackson for about five blocks before it hit her that she was going to be late and had to run for her next audition. First Meeting In 1987, Tatiana Thumson was sent on an audition for a music video shoot, but wasn't told whose video it was for. The 27-year-old model was told to walk and show some attitude. The scene took place on a street in a rough area. A bunch of guys start hassling the character she was reading for, taunting her with lines like, Hey baby, what's up? After impressing Jackson's team, uh, Tatiana was then asked to you attend a low-key dress rehearsal. This is when she would discover the video was in fact from Michael Jackson and his song, The Way You Make Me Feel. Quote, Michael was there, but I was too shy to even look at him at first. The choreographer directed me to go through some moves, which I followed perfectly. Finally, I glanced up at Michael. He was sitting there in a red shirt, bopping to the music with this big, happy grin on his face. I saw him turn to the person next to him and say something. After meeting the young model, Michael Jackson had apparently said to the video director, She's the one. The rest are extras. Jackson handpicked her himself out of 200 women. One of the reasons he chose her was because he wanted a girl to whom he felt a real sexual attraction with. Oh. Upon hearing the news, Tatiana recounted that she screamed so loud that all of Hollywood must have heard it. It was a milestone accomplishment for her that she finally made it, and her career would soon be taking off. While on the shoot, Thumson went into wardrobe and it was agreed that she would wear a short black dress the exact look that she wore for the original audition taping. The boots were hers and the bracelets were hers too. Although painfully shy and intimidated by the musical icon, Tatiana attempted to break the ice by asking Jackson what he was going to wear. Dressed simply in black pants, a white t-shirt, and a long-sleeved royal blue shirt with a white sash tied in a bow at the front, Tatiana felt she was overdressed compared to his costume. But Jackson said in a soft voice, um, this is what I'm wearing. 
Tatiana Thumsen described being on set that day, watching Michael Jackson dance and that, quote, it was even more amazing to see him in person. You can tell he has so much passion for what he does. Between the mini breaks on the five-day video shoot, Thumsen admitted to Jackson that she saw him years ago in New York and that she followed him a few blocks. He laughed and said, oh really, why didn't you say something? Truly ironic that Tatiana Thumsen just a few years previously had followed him on the streets of New York, and now here he was, the one chasing her, through a set made to look like the Big Apple in his new music video. Both were shy and awkward at first, but chemistry between them started to heat up as the days went on. Getting into the mood of the video, Thumsen recalls how Jackson approached her up close and boldly studied her butt. He asked if she was a ballerina and was impressed that she was trying to dance <laughs> on her toes. Tatiana revealed that during the filming of The Way You Make Me Feel, Jackson flirted with her a lot. During one take, the heel of Tatiana's boot was caught in the car's upholstery, and Michael put his hand on her leg to help pull it out. When she pulled away, she began to tumble out of the car, falling on her butt, as the director Joe Pitka yelled, Get up! Keep it going and don't stop! As she did, Michael got out of the car and started wiping her butt off. Quote, The fall caused a run in my stockings and the stylist wanted me to change. I started walking off the set and Michael asked, Where are you going? I explained, but he disapproved by saying no. I like it. I think the run is neat. It's sexy. Working with such close proximity to each other over the five-day video shoot, affections grew I'm between sorry. the two. <laughs> Too shy to ask himself, Tatiana was approached by one of Michael's own security to see if she had a boyfriend. A bit later, Latoya, Michael's sister and mother, Catherine, arrived on the set and Thumbsin was introduced to them. After completing the video's choreographed dance segment, Michael Jackson requested a closed set for the two's final scene. No one was allowed on set other than people necessary to the shoot. That meant no dancers, visitors, or extras. So just the cameraman? It was rumored that the two were scripted to kiss at the end of the video scene, but the director came up to Tatiana and whispered in her ear, quote, Don't kiss him. He's too shy for that. And she respected his direction. Between the scenes, Michael said to Tatiana, I heard you wanted to dance in this video. She laughed and admitted it was true, which Michael replied, Don't worry, we'll work together again. Love Blossoms Immediately after the shoot wrapped, Michael Jackson flew to Japan to begin the first leg of his Bad World Tour. The completed music video oh, wow. was released in November 1987, and as a result, Tatsuyata Thumbsin became an overnight video star and was recognized wherever she went. A few months later in January 1988, during a break in performing, Jackson got in contact with Tatiana again to invite her on set for the video's single, Leave Me Alone. Located in Culver City, Thumbsin arrived on the lot while Michael was between takes and he seemed genuinely pleased to see her, immediately telling her that The Way You Make Me Feel was currently charting at number one that week. For the rest of her visit, he was full on smiles as his personal photographer paired the Aww, two for photos. that's a cute picture. Using a full roll of film for the, the couple. Hat. Allegedly, smile was cute. Michael Jackson also wanted to feature his new love interest in the music video for the single Dirty Diana. Thumbsin recounts that she received a message from Michael's office to audition for the video, but when she asked Frank DeLeo, Michael's manager, about it, he said he was keen to not have the same girl for two different videos. Quote, you don't want to be known for doing too many videos, and the role is a negative character. Just leave it be. What? In Joe Jackson's book published in 2004, Joe recalls Michael Jackson's relationship with Tatiana. Quote, He invited the girl to our home so that my wife and I could get to know her. She was young, beautiful, and she oh, had the heart of a child. She met the parents? Tatiana Thumson has said that the entire Jackson Both family parents? liked her, that Michael's nephews and nieces even called her Tatiana Jackson. Tatiana also recounts oh. that Michael's mother told her that he was in love with her. Joe Jackson recalled that, quote, Michael has admitted to his mother that he was in love with the wonderful dancer. There was a strong sexual attraction between them, but he would like to know her better. As a result, oh. Tatiana was invited to perform with Michael Jackson on several dates of the bad tour once it arrived in the U.S. Seeing his tours as a way to bring alive the videos that made his music so popular, Having Tatiana perform the now famous The Way You Make Me Feel routine with him on stage was important to him, but also allowed him time to get to know her while he was traveling the world and performing to millions. Tensions Build In late February 1988, while performing as a dancer on Michael Jackson's tour, Tatiana said Jackson told his crew members never to talk to her outside of work, which she also perceived as meaning 
don't even think about trying to get with her. But at the same time, she never got to be alone with him and longed to finally get some time with the man she had suddenly fallen for. The only time she saw Michael was on stage or on television. She was isolated from others and was usually alone in her hotel room watching movies or wondering what Michael was doing. Quote, I felt as though I was some sort of Barbie doll that they took out of the box when they needed to show it off. But I kept getting all these reports that Michael was in love with me. It was confusing and lonely yeah, to be Yeah, I was going to say, that's confusing. On March 1st, a People magazine piece aired interviewing Tatiana. Michael's PR team set up the interview, but surprisingly, Michael did not know anything about it until later. To her surprise, but not to her dismay, the story read as though Michael had found his soulmate in her. This piece triggered a flurry of tabloid attention on the couple, and Thumbsin was their target. Regularly receiving phone calls from reporters from her hotel room, they asked her all sorts of questions about Michael. Quote, I put them off by saying, I've got to go. What's it like working with Michael? I finally gave in and replied, I love it, it's great. But what was printed was that I said, I love him. That's the tabloids for the you, that's day, the media. March 2nd, Tatiana performed with Jackson for the Messy. 1988 Grammy Awards at the famed Radio City Music Hall. Quote, Four years earlier, I had cried about not being able to attend a Michael Jackson concert, and now here I was, a special feature in one. After Thumbsin had acted out her part on stage, she stood in the wings watching the rest of Jackson's performance. Quote, I was deeply lost in a trance, like everyone else. Someone walked in front of me, and, and as I shifted my position, the woman turned to me and said, Oh, excuse me. It was the one and only Miss Diana Ross. She was the woman that Michael admired as he grew up. Well, so had I. Just a few days later, Thumbsin performed at New York's Madison Square Garden as part of Jackson's tour. Strutting back and forth across the stage, she decided to change up the routine. That's Having the little time to spend with Jackson in private, Tatiana became tempted to act out her desires for him during their performance by grabbing his collar and landing a big kiss on his cheek. The fans went berserk, and she left the stage. She heard a laugh in every note Michael sang. The dancers told her that he was happy and excited about the kiss telling her, oh boy, you just made Michael's day. He was Ooh. happy. The next night was the last time was Thumbsin bold. was scheduled to perform, and she decided to call Michael to ask if it would be all right if she could take it a step further. Oh, sure, that'll be great, he answered. After all, he would pull a girl out of the audience and embrace her. Why would a kiss from someone he already knew be a big deal? The next night, when Thumbsin stepped on stage, there was that roar from the audience again. They were fired up. Quote, for a few brief seconds, I thought about whether or not I should follow through on the kiss. As I stepped up to him and put my arms around his collar, he looked deep into my eyes, almost as though he was challenging me. Then he did this sexy little thing where he bit his bottom lip. I placed my arm around his waist, and I landed a kiss right on his mouth. After her performance, Thumbsin walked backstage and immediately felt hostility towards her from Jackson's team, even though Michael's mother, Catherine, walked towards her and gave her a warm, embracing hug. At the hotel, Tatiana was approached by Michael Brando, Marlon Brando's son and Michael's friend, yelling at the top of his lungs. How dare you f take advantage of him like that, you f bitch. Who the f do you think you are? I cannot believe you f took advantage of him like that in front of all those people. It was at this point Tatiana Thumbson realized <laughs> she had possibly made a terrible mistake. But wait a minute, Watch I'm part confused. Two michael was cool with it so i don't understand why he was mad about it uh michael brando or whoever he said he was um i don't understand like why he was upset but michael was cool with it and he even said that the uh that the crew like everybody else was upset upset with her for what she did i'm sorry but i don't see what she if michael was okay with it i don't see what she did wrong i mean maybe it was a little bit too much i don't know but I don't I don't see what why he just went off on her like that but yeah that was my reaction to this video guys if you enjoyed my reaction please make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and I will see you in my next reaction video